Take two. Be thankful. That's where it begins. Being thankful. Uh, I remember the verse a long time ago that I uh, I put to memory. It was in Thessalonians. It says, Rejoice evermore, pray without ceasing, and in all things give thanks, for this is the will of God concerning you in Christ Jesus. Being thankful uh, as a Christian is essential. Good times and in bad times. And I know it's extremely difficult because I speak of uh, myself personally. So being thankful for God, for what he has done and what we have and what we see, the air we breathe, the sun that rises every morning and it sets every evening. And so we are called to be thankful, to open our eyes and to see the wonderfulness of God that surrounds us in nature, in his creation and in other people that are created in his image whether they be for us or against us, whether they be nice or not so nice. And so thankfulness is where we begin. And sometimes you got to manufacture that up. Sometimes you got to say, I'm thankful. And in your depth that you're not. And I've experienced that myself. So, but God says, be thankful. He says, come into his, his, his gates with praise and thanksgiving. And so we praise the Lord for who he is and we're thankful for what, what he's done. And above all, you know, his son, Jesus Christ. And so start your day every day by being thankful. We all have something to be thankful for. And so look at that little thing. Like I'm thankful I put my feet on the floor and I got up out of bed. And so whatever that thing is, start there every morning and carry it throughout the day just with little things. Um, and you'll start to see a change. You really will. Just to be thankful. So that's my word right now. I'm on the road. I'm working hard. I am not hardly working. And uh, I just wanted to share that with you because I was thinking of it as I was traveling. A heart of thankfulness. That's pleasing to God. But it also changes your attitude also towards him. Just being thankful. So, okay. Ciao.